Hello boys and girls, welcome to another raffle for TVC. This one is a winner picks. This is raffle number 612. We are cracking through them now, 612. Guns N' Roses, Judgment Night, Ian Brown, or um, George Michael. George Michael, the best review of an album I've ever seen to this day. It was in the NME when it first came out, and it was Listen Without Speakers, which I thought was a bit harsh, but brilliant. Anyway, 25 spots, 7 people covering them. This is a raffle 612. 612, we're rattling through these at a fair old pace these days. Um, but before we get started, a couple of apologies. First of all, uh, sorry for being so late on this one. I mean, I'm not late. I'm not past the uh, page's 24-hour limit. But uh, I'm later than I normally am. I'm decorating the house, and that always takes three times as long as you think it would. Um, and I'm still not finished. Uh, it doesn't look like I'm going to get it finished by the end of the day, which is a real pain in the arse because I'm back to work tomorrow. Anyway. So apologies for the slight delay on that one. Apologies for the appearance, which is also related to the decorating. Um, you know, I'm in a state. Look at me. Uh, so apologies for that, but I didn't want to wait any longer. I didn't want to get this any later. And this is technically my lunch break before I get back to work. Right, and that's about it. Oh, third apology, the location. Normally I do it in the front room, but that's covered in shit at the moment. So you've moved to the inner sanctum of Rappledon. You're in my bedroom now, so control yourselves. Right, 25 spots all in the bag. A uh, big old mix to start with, as always, and then every five spots, every five pulls, we'll give them a little mini mix, and that'll go all the way through to the end, unless we get to sudden death. If we get to sudden death, we'll get an extra mix. Uh, last one pulled is our winner. Right, let's crack on. I think we can safely say they are nicely mixed. Let's tip them all into one corner, that way no one avoids the pull, and off we go. P. What do I do with my pen? P for pen. Uh, P. Uh, Gary. K. Steve. There's a couple of Steves in here. This one's Steve Bell. I'm oh, talking to a couple of Steves. I haven't done the runners and riders, have I? Uh, seven people covering 25 spots. Steve Cromer on five. George Fraser and Steve Bell also all on five. Uh, Gary on two. Matthew on two. And Gareth is our one and only one hit wonder. Sorry about that. Out uh, of sorts today, considering I'm uh, in the other room. It's broken my routine. B. Gary Weeks. Mate, you've there's three spots pulled and two of them are yours. And you only had two, so we've lost you there. Thanks for playing, man. Unlucky. That's a bit harsh. Lose Gary early doors. E is George. Spot five. Oh, fucking dropped it. Spot five is T. There's Matthew Shirley. Let's hope I don't drop any more, eh? Uh, there we go. That's five down. See, you, you break up someone's routine and it all goes to pot. Uh, why? That's a double pull for Matthew. It is a double pull, isn't it? T and Y. Thank you. T, Y. Yep, double pull. Well, it's worse than double pull because it's double bubble and burst. You only had two spots and we lose you there. Thanks for playing. Unlucky. You. Uh, you, Steve Bell. F. F. Why can't I find F? A, B, C, D, E, F. Steve Bell again. Is that another double pull? U and F. Uh, yes, it was. Mate, this draw has not been very forgiving to people. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. It's Steve Bell. A triple pull. Put you on your last spot, brother. That's harsh. I, please don't be Steve Bell. Nope, it's Fraser King. First spot. All right, that's 10 down. Time for another little jiggle. I really don't like doing it in the bedroom. It's, uh, yeah, it's just making me a bit out of sorts on this draw. Fraser King. I do believe that was another double pull. G spot baby is George. W. 
That's another double pull. This is getting ridiculous. This is getting ridiculous. That's the third or possibly fourth double pull, and we've had a treble. It has been a harsh draw. M. That's another tri triple pull. What is going on in this draw? Puts you in your last spot, George. At least it's not an elimination. That's something. Q. Fraser. In a very, very strange draw, this one. Anyway, that's 15 down. Halfway, well, over halfway through. 10 down, that's 10 left. Jesus Christ, I'm, I'm, my brain is, is fatigued. I hate DIY. It's, it's, <sighs> All right. 10 spots to go, I believe. So, best of luck. And Steve Cromer, I've still got five of them. He's been untouched. C, commentator's curse. That's one for Steve. A N. A double pull for another double pull. What's that? Four? Five double pulls? It's been a crazy raffle. R. George. I think we lose George there. Yeah, we do. Sorry, brother. Thanks for playing, man. Unlucky. Hope your shop went well, by the way. I haven't spoken to you about that. V. Fraser. Down to your last spot, Fraser. In fact, everyone is on sudden death except for Steve Promar. I say everyone. There's only Gareth, Steve, Bell and Fraser left. So, X. Oh, there goes Steve Bell. Unlucky brother. Thanks for playing, man. Right, down to the last five. Let's move those out of the way. Last five. Uh... One for Gareth, one for Fraser, three for Steve. That's a pretty good advantage going into a uh, going into the last five pulls, but uh, it's been a funny raffle. We've had a lot of triples, had a lot of doubles. What's going to happen next? J, Steve. D. Fraser. No, nope, we lose you there. Sorry, brother. Thanks for playing. Unlucky. Uh, three spots left. One belonging to... Steve Promar started on five, down to his last two. Gareth started on one. Still has his one. So are we going to get sudden death, or are we going to get an anti-climax? H. Steve Promar. It is sudden death. That's worth the last jiggle. It's hard to jiggle when you've only got a couple left, but we'll give it a go. So this has been a really strange draw. We've had a couple of triple pulls. We've had a whole raft of double pulls. Um, and now we're down to the last two spots. Steve started on five, down to his last one. Gareth started on one, one hit wonder, uh, and still has it, he's still alive. Enough waffle, more raffle. Get ourselves a winner, shall we? Best of luck. Off we go. Runner up is A. Gareth. So close to a one hit wonder. Bridesmaid. Unlucky brother. Thanks for playing. So, our winner, unless something's gone horribly wrong, which it hasn't, it's S. Steve Cromar. Good strong name, that Steve. Um, comes from the Latin meaning leader of men. Did you know that? Or is it bullshit? Have I just made that up? Ah, oh, you'll have to Google it and find out. Anyway, congratulations, mate. You've won whatever it is you've won. I don't know what you're going to pick on that one. I don't think you've ever won one of mine before. I'm not even sure if you've ever played in one of mine before. If this was your first raffle with me, as I say, apologies. Different scenario, different setting. And quite an odd little raffle. That was quite a few little uh, doubles and triples, which is... Uh, I don't know why I keep doing that. It's a fucking OCD. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for playing. That concludes our raffle. Uh, Steve, get in contact with me. Let me know what you want and where I'm shipping it to. Everyone else, as always, thanks for playing and hopefully see you all on the next one. Cheers now. Bye.